This is such an exciting week as we celebrate the miracle of what Jesus did for us when He forgives us, when He overcomes death, He overcomes the grave, He gives us eternal life. There's nothing like Resurrection Sunday. And we start on Friday with the Good Friday Focus 1215. I hope you could come and join us. We've got room for you and the stage is set up remarkably. You're going to love our experience with the music. We've got a string orchestra, an amazing opportunity for us to worship God in such a contemplative environment. Really, it's going to be touching and impacting in our lives. I can't wait for it. 1215, our Good Friday service where we remember the sacrifice of Jesus. And we turn out of that into Sunday, Resurrection Sunday, 9 and 11. You don't need to register in advance to come. We just open the doors. We'd love to see you there. If you have children, bring them a little early so that we can get everybody checked in through the children's process properly. There's bags of candy for the kids. There's going to be a great celebration that they will have. And then in our service in the sanctuary, 9 and 11, amazing music to worship Jesus, the resurrected one. And a message that will encourage you and give hope about what God is doing in our life and where he's taking us in the days ahead. What a great weekend. Hope you can be there. If you can't be there in person, we'll be online in each of those times. Good Friday, 1215, Easter Sunday, 9 and 11. And let me share this thought with you from Hebrews 12 2. Looking unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith, who for the joy that was set before him, endured the cross despising the shame and has sat down at the right hand of the throne of god that says so much in one verse how jesus for the joy set before him the joy was knowing that you and i would be connected to him and we get to worship him and it brings great joy to his heart and he endured great trials in order to experience unbelievable joy and he plants that joy in us looking forward to seeing you this weekend Invite somebody, in fact, bring somebody along. Invite them in, either online or in person. It's all about letting someone else know the joy of who Jesus is. It's Resurrection Sunday.